<clears throat> hey, Solo Gamer back, and you know, I just decided we're just going to go ahead and move, because, you know, it's just, we're not on a time limit yet, so, one, two, and then we will do an event card. I want him to kind of catch up with her anyways. No spawning, and a clone activates. All right. <clears throat> Now, his threat is higher. Well, the clone, the threat for my guy here is higher, so the clone will move, actually, to get out of there. Okay, now it's the girl's turn. Okay. And she will move one. And here's the incinerator. Okay, there's the incinerator, but I can't do nothing with that, so I move back here. Move these back a little bit. Okay. So, that's that. So, we have to draw an event for her. And this is a guard. We have to spawn a guard. So, let's do that. Spawn a guard. And let's see here. Uh, the guard's going to spawn in her room, as a matter of fact. And he's going to activate. He's going to attack her. Yeah, he did three. She's at one, so she loses two more of these cards. Okay, it's my guy's turn, and let's see here. I will move him one, two, and then draw an event card because there's nothing, there's nothing for me to do there. So, let's see here. We don't spawn anything. And we have activation. And the guard, of course, is going to attack the girl. She has the higher threat. Her fear is not four. Okay, well, he took one damage on her. So, she, does an she loses another, da another thing. Dang. Fix this. Okay. All right, so she's back. Okay, he attacked her, and now it's her turn. And she can draw two cards. Okay. First of all, she's going to do, she's going to play this right here, lose two fear and gain plus two intelligence. Okay, so she's got to come back down. That gives her two, four, six, seven intelligence, which he's going to try to do. That's pretty good. And try to outwit these guys. Okay, yeah, that's no problem. So she moves, and she moves one. And we have no item thing on this. This is just getting crazy. Okay. And now she has to do an event. <clears throat> okay, nothing is done. This guard will move into here. This guard will move into here. He's, remember, she has the higher threat. And then we have place a locked door marker on a door in your tile. God, pass a four intelligence handles or play. Okay. Okay, well, she should pass. To yeah, she does that. So we got to put another locked door on this thing. Okay, and then she has to do this one. Gain up to four fear. Spawn that clone on adjacent tile for a point you didn't gain. Up to four. Okay, she's down at two, so she will go all the way up to six. And not spawn any, not spawn any more fear. Okay, so this is this is where we're at here. This is just getting out of control. So I want to move him one, and then he's going to try to unlock this door. And he has a scalpel, so he's going to use this to try to gain a strength here to do this. So that'll give him a three strength. Yeah. Okay, and he passed it. All right, so, just barely, but he did it. So he unlocks that door. <clears throat> now he can move one here. And this is another stupid thing here with nothing, no items. So we have to do <clears throat> an event card. And we have to spawn another guard. So spawn another guard. 
and this one will spawn here and it says uh let's see move a clone one tile in any direction move a clone that shares a tile with at least one guard gain two fear okay i can move a clone any one direction so he'll go here and then the guards will activate uh guard one moves here guard two will attack her and guard three will go in there so guard two is attacking and he did three so shoes so he put her back he took her life and she is back in the infirmary man so let's put her vitality down to three her threats going to back down to three i mean her fear and she loses her threat tokens and she lost her items there okay and that's that so now it would be her turn so we give her three adrenaline cards because she's down to three now all right so we can start her in any room with a vent and guess what we got a room with a vent right here so we will put her in there and then we we'll move it up and we have an item icon thank god finally okay so we move her in here all right, let's see what her intelligence is right now. Okay, her two, four. Uh, maybe I can make her lose two fear. It's risky, but we'll do it. Lose two fear, that's six. And it goes down all the way to one, so that's seven. Now she should be able to pass this little five intelligence test. Okay, two, four, six seven uh two four seven eight so yes she passed it she got a map fragment <clears throat> okay first let's do the event and this event is a facility one attempt a five intelligence channel if you fail this card an adrenaline card if you fail by three more okay well she shouldn't fail because she still has her intelligence boost. one two three four five she did not fail all right, so we don't have to worry about that. <clears throat> and we have to do the guard moves and the clone moves. So, uh, this guard right here, he's that thing has a higher threat. So he will attack that clone. He does not defeat it. This guard, though, will move here. This guard will move here. And then this clone will activate and... See, actually, this guy has the higher fear, so the clone will move. Okay, so there's that. Okay, it's going to be the guy's turn. All right, let's see what he wants to do. If we can get rid of some of these guards, we might can do something here. Okay, he's got to use his gun. Gain three strength. He already has a strength of three. So that's six. Six strength. Okay, we got one, two, three, four, five, six. That's double what he needed. Seven, actually. So that's double what he needed. <clears throat> so he did kill this guard. This guard right here has been destroyed. And with the gun, I guess he destroyed this guard. Okay, but now his threat. Okay, it says after you attempt a challenge with this bonus, gain one threat and either pass a three intelligence. Which he's going to do. He's going to gain a threat and he has to pass a three intelligence. Uh, he did not. And he has to discard the gun card. Okay, so he did that. So... He can move with her. That's one. All right, and let's see. He's probably just gonna stay in there with her. Um, yeah, we'll do an event here. And this is no nothing spawning. And the clone moves. And this clone's gonna move. This guy has the, that guy still has the higher fear, so he's gonna move up here. Okay, it's gonna be her turn. So let's see what we're going to do. Okay, so. We have a vent in this room, and so she's going to move through the vent and come to the 
incinerator control room okay and that's basically going to end her turn but she has to up her fear so we'll do that we'll give her another adrenaline card <clears throat> and then next turn she can try a challenge to access there but now we have to do an event card nothing and the clone will move Yeah, I think he should be right there. Okay, so the guy's turn, and he's going to do the same thing. He's going through the event, but before he does that, <clears throat> he's going to lose one fear and gain an intelligence. But now he goes to the event, and he is basically his fear is leveled where it was. Okay, so he's there, and he's not going to do anything. So let's next turn, and now we have guard activation. So the guard will activate and we did okay now it's her turn <clears throat> all right she has to do a special access challenge to open the incinerator accessing the incinerator is a six intelligence challenge okay <clears throat> and of course we have to spawn the hybrids in the airlock so let's do that real quick we have one hybrid here so let's spawn a hybrid in the airlock which we do Okay, so the hybrid spawns there, because it, it said um, at the end of a turn in which a player move a token from the lockdown pool. So I should have did that, <clears throat> and <clears throat> what would have happened was this hybrid would have moved in there, and the guard would have moved in there, and I should have I moved a lockdown token. Okay, so now it's her turn. It actually should be two turns, so I should take another lockdown and move it, and these two would fight. <clears throat> And the hybrid did not kill the guard. Okay, now it's her turn now. All right, so she has an intelligence. She's going to automatically, she's going to play this, lose one fear. So she's gained one intelligence, and that puts her back all the way down to one. So that plus one is two, four, six. All right, so she has six intelligence. All right. Six intelligence. <clears throat> All right, baby. All we need is six, and we're okay. Come on, we should do this. You know what? I take that back. I'm not going to play that one. I'm going to play lose two fear and gain two intelligence, so I'm going to get seven. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> what did I get? One, two, three. Oh, that's freaking terrible. Oh, that's terrible. Ugh. You stink, lady. Okay, so it's our guy's turn. Okay, that was her turn. That was her action, and she's gonna stay there. So we have to do an event, and we gotta spawn a guard. So spawn a guard. Mm. We'll spawn a guard in this, the guard's nest, and then we have a guard activation and a clone activation. Of course, we have to take a thing from the lockdown pool, which we do. Okay, so. Spawn the guard. Let's do our first guard. He's going to attack the hybrid. He does not kill it. Then we have the clone of this guard, and he will move here. Then we have the clone. Ah, who's got the biggest fear right now? She's low. He's still got a bigger fear, so this guy will move here. He's trying to find, he can go through a vent and try to find them. But this hybrid gets to attack. And he does not kill the guy. Okay. So it's our guy's turn here. And he's got these adrenaline cards. And he's going to play this, lose one fear. He's going to play this, lose another fear. Uh, and he's going to play this to lose another fear. It's three cards. So, one, two, three, four, five. He gets five dice to get a six pass and test. Come on. One, two, dang, he didn't get it. Ugh. Okay. Dang, that's terrible. All right, let's do a vent. Now we got to spawn another guard. So let's spawn another guard. We'll put another one there. 
and then the guard activation. So we have this guard will attack this hybrid, and he kills the hybrid. So the hybrid is dead. Of course, we took that off of there, so that means we just reset. <laughs> and you know what that means? We put another hybrid back in the airlock. Okay, number two then, we'll move to that because that guy is a higher threat, and number three will move to there as well. Okay, so it's the girl's turn. She can draw one adrenaline card. Okay, <clears throat> she's gonna try again. All right, two, four, five, six. So she gets six this time. Come on, lady. Oh, I got it. Two, four, six, seven, eight. Very good. So we got eight dice. Okay. Lockdown has started now. So that was her one action. <clears throat> and basically, she can move. <laughs> uh, she's going to have to stay. Because when she moves through events, she's going to lose two health. If she loses two health now, she goes to the infirmary. I don't want her to go to the infirmary. So, she's going to have to stay. So, lockdown, we take a token from there. And we draw an event and we spawn another guard. So, we'll put another guard there. Well, we actually have to spawn another guard, but another guard, another hybrid. So what we will do is that. Okay, so because we got the two hybrids there, we have to spawn a guard for every guard space and guard nest. So we're going to be putting a lot of guards on this board here. So let's, wow. And then they will activate, which is kind of weird, though, because I don't know. So we put one here. Let's put one here we have to put one we don't have to put one there uh, there there we'll put one there we have to put one there and we have to put one there okay <clears throat> and then it says they activate okay so <clears throat> what's gonna happen is is the guards we gotta look at that I mean we look at this look at that that is just, look at that whole map filled with people. And we're stuck over here. And all we got to do is get into there. All right, so what's going to happen? Okay. <clears throat> Snow clones are activating, <clears throat> but the guards are. So let's do them in order. Uh, okay. Now these guys still have the higher threat. So this guard will move into here. This guard will attack a hybrid. It does not kill him. Number three, their reserve limit is secure numbers two, so they can't go in there. So number three will go here. Number four will go here. Number five will go here. Number six will go here. Uh, number seven will go here. Number eight, I guess, will go here. And number nine will go there. <clears throat> well, wait a minute. He still has a higher fear, a higher threat. So I guess he will not go there. He will try to go here so he can go that way into there. Okay. <clears throat> and so now it's the guy's turn. <clears throat> and we will get him some uh, adrenaline cards. All right, so um, solo gamer saying we'll come back in a minute and we should be able to finish up the game. I'll Hi. see you then.